One of the most impressive handsets on display at CES this year came from a company you've probably never heard of. The Wistra New Web Corporation of Taiwan was showing off a prototype of their GW4 Linux-based smartphone. Wistron said that the GW4 is all ready for Android, so this might be one of the first Google phones you're going to see on the market later this year, if you live in Europe where it's going to be released. The GW4 is Linux-based, it features a touchscreen, a QWERTY keypad, built-in Wi-Fi, and it's all packed into one of the lightest form factors you're going to find on a full-on smartphone. It's also one of the fastest, most responsive phones I've ever used. Even though its specs aren't totally top of the line, the Linux OS is lightweight and efficient, and so the phone really responded, as you can see here, as I'm mousing around with the D-pad and also using the touchscreen. Which one? The prototype that I played with wasn't 3G and didn't even have Edge. It used the slower GPRS for cellular data. But again, it did have built-in Wi-Fi. There was also a 2 megapixel camera on the phone, and as you can see here, it was loaded up with a bunch of applications, including the Opera browser, which really worked quite well in my tests. There's no official information on pricing or release date, although the spokesperson I talked to at the booth said probably March. Look for more on this very interesting Linux-based smartphone and everything else related to the Google-backed Android mobile OS on PhoneDog.com.